David Rivers, believe it or not, was the best player ever coached at Notre Dame. And people go, what? Turn around. Oh, stolen by Rivers. Wow, that's the master. So David gets around Perry. Rivers. David. Heard kind of the billing of what kind of player he was. But when he arrived on campus, everything Coach Phelps said that he was, he really was. Digger obviously hyped him up pretty well and comes in, he's around 150 pounds. He looks like a little skinny, scrawny little kid. And I said, this is the kid who's gonna be that good. And, you know, first day of practice, you know, you could see it. Now from the moment that David Rivers stepped on the court at Notre Dame, he was the guy who was running things. He was the guy that made everybody else better. He was one of the few guys who can literally take over a game on both ends of the floor. You know, all she had to do with David was run and be ready to catch the ball because uh, he was a, he was looking. It looked like it seemed like he had nine eyes. He could see everybody. I, I imagine the game was very slow for him in his head because it seemed like he never made a mistake. At least from my perspective. You know, he directed the offense. He directed the defense, and they all looked up to David. You know, as a team leader. And this was probably from his freshman year on. You know, I really admired him uh, quite a bit just on how he handled himself dealing with pressure of coming into a major program like Notre Dame. Rivers in the paint. Nice pass off to Royal. He stuffs it on. We expected him to make spectacular plays each and every night. He could do things with the basketball that very few people could do. He was also a tenacious defender. He could score, and if they took him away, he would feed other people. I mean, he really was a generational basketball player. Rivers, 16-footer is good. You know, he was going to make a full recovery. It was just going to take a while. After the initial accident, everybody thought, there's no way he's playing this year. I mean, he can't possibly play, even if he wants to. But David wouldn't hear anything of it. He was tough. He was tougher than that. To see a guy bounce back as fast and as quickly as he did, taking baby steps in terms of uh, his minutes on the court, but he just gradually improved throughout the year. Steals, Rivers gets it back. <laughs> Coming back from it, was more tied to that hungry kid who would do whatever he needed to do to get to practice. The accident and the comeback puts him on a different plane. It shows a depth of character and toughness and unselfishness. David fakes, drives, lays it off the glass and in. Rivers in the paint to Rivers, he fakes. Nice pass on the baseline to Stevenson. You know, I was trying to do things right. My heart was right. My spirit, uh, my relationship with Christ was strong. And I had great people around. When I look at what he accomplished here at Notre Dame as a point guard, as I look in the game of life, David's doing the same thing, giving people assist and how they can win. Trying to do what's right and to help others, that's kind of what David Rivers is all about. Just a quality guy. I, I love David Rivers. You look back at all the special people who received awards, and they're all special people. You know, and David's another one of those great athlete, great person, great family, and very glad for him.